eleven dollars. Oh, hang on. Sir. Excuse me. Eleven dollars. Hang on. Uh. Uh. Oh, look. I only have a dollar. Sorry. A uh, dollar. I. That's all I have. Wait a minute. You're one of the book guys. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm the book. on TV. Yeah, I'm one of the book guys. On the TV yeah. show, That's right? right? Yeah, yeah. Hey, it's on me. Oh, I love you. Bless you. That's very kind. Okay. Yeah. See you. Bye. <laughs> The Further Adventures of the Book Boys. Join our bookbinding buddies as they pay a visit to the Preservation Department of the San Francisco Public Library. Oh, hi, Marie. Hi, Marie. Hello. Oh, it's nice to see you. Nice to see you again. Uh, in your new room, golly. Yeah. Is, uh, uh, Marie. The, uh, mm. John. Here we are in the repair unit of the Preservation Department with our friend, Marie. Hello. Uh, Marie and, uh, is the book repair uh, <laughs> preservation manager well, uh, here, but um, uh, we have a slight problem, slight, uh, Marie. Um, you know these uh, San Francisco cab drivers. <laughs> <laughs> we thought he was a friend. So um, mm. we were returning our library books, and, and, and something terrible happened to them. So um, we were wondering whether you we might be able to, um, to do, something. do something for us. And, what what uh, do you think? Maybe we, we could help you. We best. Yeah, we'd be, we'd be happy to help, you know, because we really we both do a little bit, bit a little bit of book yeah. binding in, in our uh, you know private lives, and yeah, and you I, may have seen us do that before. I, I've brought a glue stick and, and uh -huh. some tape, and I, I thought I might be able to help out. What do you think? Well, we have a wonderful staff here that can uh, yeah. handle all the book repairs. We have a full staff of people here. Oh, uh, okay. So, why don't you tell us about a little bit about what goes on in your room, the book repair room in the preservation department, and maybe we can see some of them at work and okay. give them a hand. Well, yeah. here we are in, in the book repair lab yeah. mm -hmm. and we have a, a staff of uh, trained people that are, are, are um, trained in the, in the techniques and the materials to do preservation work. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, they're, they're all um, at their benches and... Working diligently. Working, working very diligently. hard. Yeah. Oh, there's a woman over there actually who's eating a sandwich. Doesn't yeah. look like she's working hard she's at all. She's not doing a thing. Oh, well, we'll have to get to her later. Yeah. Tell her off. Well, great, Marie, you're going to start, I think, by telling us how uh, the books come in. And then you get to look at them first, and you decide what's going to happen to them. And we see them. you so put our books on this cart here. Is oh, this yes. The yes. Yeah, I'll we just slip mine in there, too. <laughs> Hopefully, we can get it worked yeah, on later. And uh, why don't you tell us what you do first? Well, when the materials come into the department, the, we um, s sort them for treatment. And there are a number of categories that we can sort them into, and um, it, it all depends upon what the nature of the book is, how the book is made, mm -hmm. how, how the cover is, um, what the paper is like. So some of these books are made a little differently than others. Some of them are, are made differently. Hard some cover, of them are, are sewn. Covers. Some of them are um, soft cover books. And um, there's any number of ways that we use to treat them, and it, it also depends upon what what the purpose of the books are in the collection. If they're meant to stay in the collection for a long-term basis, we will treat them differently than, say, reference materials or items that are not meant to be in the collection for mm -hmm. a long period of time, and mm -hmm. that all depends upon the librarian or the selector. Okay. Well, I think that's a pretty good uh, description of what what we're going to uh, what you do, what we're going to look at. Let's. Uh, Let's start, shall we, Let's with, see what uh, we do with in number the one? Lab. Great. Okay. Hi, Heather. Hi, Marie. Hello. Hey, John. Hi, hey, Dominic. Oh, hi, Heather. I think uh, we have a book here that needs uh, something done with the hinge here. It's kind of loose mm -hmm. when I move it. And um, in the front, I think it needs a new end sheet. It's yeah, kind it's of It's almost coming here. off there completely, okay. you can see. Oh. Oh, good. Well, our friend Heather Nichols here is going to fix this book, and we're going to watch her do it. Hi, Heather. Hey. Yeah. Um, Heather and I went to the same school. We went, both went to the London College of Printing, and, uh, uh, you know, we both learned a lot. She's got a real job. I haven't. And, He's uh, forgotten everything he knows. I had certainly, well, I didn't learn much. And um, so Heather, He was just you, there for the food. Yeah. I, well, can, I love canteen food. Uh, Heather, are you going to show us how to do this book? Yes. Okay, yeah. let's take a look. Let's take a look. Okay. Well, first of all, um, I'm going to take the cover off this book. Uh-huh. 
Just uh, cut. Now, oh, careful. That's not the cover you're cutting off there. No, I'm just cutting the tape. Right. Oh, the dust jacket. Oh, the dust jacket. Yeah. Oh, right, because this book has two yeah. covers. It has a cover and a cover. A cover. Yeah, sorry yeah. about the terminology. It has a uh, binding, and then it has a dust jacket, right? Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to take off the uh, old end sheet. Right. Why are you removing that old end sheet, Heather? Because it's broken. Oh, OK. On the edge. Oh. You're just going to pull it off. Oh, yep. my goodness. Mm, goodness. OK. And then? It was just sort of tipped on in the first place, wasn't it? That's yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. And then I'm going to take off. Oh, I see. Is any of this coming back to you, Dominic? Yeah, vaguely. I, well, yeah. I used to cut out security strips from yeah. books all the time. Yeah. Oh, that was in a yeah. different part of my career, of course. Uh. OK. So, and I'm going to cut this. Oh, it's a little such a piece shame. of uh, cheesecloth there, huh? Oh. Well, it's not what very is that? strong. Oh. Hmm. It's called Mall or Super, and it goes on the back mm. of the book. Remember We've Mall? talked about this yeah. in our other shows. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Good. Oh, what are you doing? You know, there's your, down to your uh, substrate material there. Mm hmm. Now I'm going to put a new end sheet on here. You run a bit of glue along there, mm. I see, yeah. And then you put your new thing on. You're very tidy, Heather. Mm. 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 Yeah, you're very messy when you work, aren't you, John? You wouldn't have done that neatly. You would have been all over the place. OK. I just put it in my pocket. Oh. And you use your finger just to do that? Mm. Yeah, you can use your finger or huh. a bone folder. Can you show us what a bone folder does? Yep. It's a little dirty, but... Oh. I see. Hmm. And now I'm going to put some super on the back, some new super. Oh, yeah. Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to cut this down to size. Oh, I wish somebody had cut John down to size. Oh, you're going to use your knife again. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Careful, careful. It's, sh it's sharp. Yeah, put an eye out with that thing. Yeah. She's in the hospital. OK. Oh, it's Ralph Nader. Mm. That's what she's repairing, Ralph Nader. Mm. Okay, and then I uh, glue this up. Same glue? You're just going yep. right over the old spine lining. Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't need to take that off then. Well, because oh. I'm only doing half of one, not a whole one. Oh, so. okay. Otherwise, you'd strip the spine. Yeah. Now, this book is in the circulating collection, right? So this is a book that people might take out for the weekend. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. so you're doing a, you have to do a strong repair, right, to make sure it doesn't break again? Yeah, try to anyway. Yeah. So I'm going to let that dry for five or ten minutes, oh, and so maybe we'll you guys can come back and I'll okay. show can you. Can we come back and visit when you're finished? Yeah. Oh, we'd love to. Okay. See you later. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Well, you know, well, you know Heather's at lunch, but uh, maybe we could give her a hand with yeah, this Yeah, it did it look easy, to... didn't it? Yeah. yeah. This well, book's broken. That one. We've right. got, we've got some my bike. lovely red tape from your bike handlebars. Put a bit on there, John. Yeah, I'm just going to slap it on there okay. so no, fast. No, 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 I'm sorry. We... Don't use that to repair Oh, Marie, what are you no, talking about? Come on, you yeah. kill Joy. We it just looks good, know. too. Look. It's much more damaging. Yeah, the the fog. Fog. Well, you, you want to take time off from your work? You get into this. It's much quicker. Uh -huh. Not in the future. Oh, all right. OK, all right. see you later. Oh, hello, Margaret. Hey. Hi. Hey. Margaret, Margaret, what are you messing Margaret, around with? Yeah. I've got this one. Let, let me help you. Oh, I'm, no, really, Marie, no, I'm really, Marie, I'm really yeah, keen to help. It's all seated. What? Let's look to see what Margaret is working on now, I think. Oh, okay. I just thought I. This might... is our friend Margaret Kugallen. Hi, Margaret. <laughs> Hi, Margaret. This is Dominic. N nice to meet yeah. you. Very, very nice. Margaret and I met at uh, Dog Obedience School. Oh, right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can we? Um, will you explain what, what Margaret's going to do? And then, Margaret, will you show us, please? Because well, I can't use my iron anymore. Mar Margaret is working on um, paper repair on paper that is torn and uh -huh. needs to be repaired. And I'll let Margaret uh, explain. This is the map you're working on here. Uh huh. It, it's from this book. Goes right in here, oh, and, uh, and it folds this is out. an old book. This is like a hundred and something years old. Amazing. That's old. Yeah. And it was torn right here, so oh, I repaired yeah. it along there. And, and what are you repairing it with? With Japanese paper uh -huh. and paste. Mm. Wheat nice. paste. Oh, you're not using uh, PVA like Heather there. No, because oh, you, don't, you don't use this tape at all. Yeah. No. Got, oh, really we, good tape. This no. is what happens when you use tape. Oh. I'll show you. It gets oh, old, uh, yellow, and brittle. Oh. See? Yeah. Oh, that's, so, oh, so we shouldn't put scotch tape on our I told right. you not to use that mm. tape. I know, but you know, it just seems so easy. Mm. OK. And you, Japanese paper can be seen through. Oh. So you don't cover up the words. Oh. But anyway, this will be folded and put back in the book. That's sort great. Of like that. Hey, yeah. thanks. Now, is that the only other kind of paper repair you do? Um, no. I'll, I'll, there's a small rip in this book. Tear. Yeah. Where is it? Actually, this is a big one. 
And um, let me start with this one. Mm -hmm. This is like an overlapping tear, and it's really easy to fix because yeah. the paper overlaps. Oh, I so. see. Yeah, yeah. You've got an edge there. You can put. You can put the There's paste a feathered edge that you can. Oh, that's good. So no, you're not even using that. a uh, Japanese paper. A tissue. No, no you, you don't need anything. You generally don't need it for this kind of work. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. You generally just yeah. need a little bit of. Uh, do you want? Oh no, that's okay. Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah, you generally the iron's all you need really for this. Yeah. Isn't that right, Margaret? That's all. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Oh, look and at that! Smend it. And what was this? Just a uh, something to keep it from sticking? Uh huh. This Silicone like release home. paper. And um, this is blotter, and this is Remy, also non-stick paper. Have you seen it on Star Trek where they cure people just by going? Uh huh. It's just like that. It's, it's like, like instant. That. It's amazing. Yeah. So I don't know what you got against our iron, though. Huh, no. It's a little too big. Clumsy, don't you think? <laughs> that's, that's Marie's problem, you see. If, if you did what we did, you could get out of here in half the time. Uh-huh, mm -hmm. exactly. You know, spend more time in the park. Okay. So this also has a, a torn edge, but it's a lot smaller. Yeah, it's harder yeah. to see. So you just put a little bit of glue there. What's that paste made from? Uh, you can see a damn thing. Uh, it's wheat paste. Made from just like flour you use in the kitchen? Yeah, it's... um. It's more pure than that, I think. They more pure. Yeah, pure. I think they oh, purify it somehow. You're refined. <laughs> oh, that's good. Let's see, and you have to make sure you get the words right. Yeah, because otherwise it will turn into a completely different story. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You ever get the pages mixed up? Oh, no, never. Never. Huh? Uh -huh. You, you, you bound a book upside down once, didn't you, John? Yeah. Yeah. Customer never noticed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so. They were dyslexic. There you go. Right. Look at that. This oh. one will need Japanese paper, though, because the edge isn't. Oh, okay. Oh, so now you're going to go over it with the... With like this, this is the thinnest Japanese with the paper thin we tissue. have. thin tissue. Wow. What's this paper called? That's silicone. Silicone release paper. Huh, silicone release paper. Uh-huh, it doesn't huh. stick. God, See? look at that. There you go. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. Okay. Hey, thank I have a little gift for you just before you leave. Oh. I thought uh, a flower might be nice to brighten your dull desk. No, oh, thanks. Thanks, Margaret. Thanks, Margaret. Let's move on. Oh, and we're back with Heather. Okay. Heather. Hi. Hi. <laughs> we tried to help you while you were gone, but, well, yeah, yeah, anyway. Yeah, uh, um, what, what, uh, at what point are you up to on this book now that it's, has it dried a little bit? Yeah, this is dried, uh, and I'm now going to trim the, um, Did you have a nice drink? Yeah. Yes. In the bar, mm -hmm. in the library bar. Yeah. That's right, they have an employee lounge now, don't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They won't let you in there. No, no, no. So now yeah. I'm going to trim this and she... Oh, can you turn it around, Heather, so we can see it to the um, camera? It's kind of hard to cut that way, but... Oh, well, can you try? Try. Good. How about if I do it this way? Yeah, 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 it's all for the public. Okay. Do you put your your ruler or or? or we never straight pretend edge? we're not on TV. Oh, no, we're always, well, every day is a TV mm -hmm. day. And then you're going to cut this off, right? Yep. Uh-huh. Yeah, with that scalpel. Oh, watch yourself, Heather, that sharp. Phew. Lose a finger that way. Oh. Wonderful. I love it. Now, now what? I'm going to glue this down uh -huh. and close the cover on it. Oh. You know about that. You know about end paper stuff, you know, gluing out the end paper. It's yeah, easy. I've heard of that. Heather's taken her time sheet from this week's work and put yeah. it into there. She's going to glue all over mm -hmm. it and throw it away. That's right. Come on, then. She hasn't been paid in months. No. Heather, no, you're on a deadline here, Heather. Come on. Yeah. Did you win all the prizes when you were at, uh, when you were at London College of Printing, Heather? I did. Did you? A few. Yeah, I got best, best in class. Did you? They give everybody a prize there, don't they? Oh, yeah. Nobody goes away empty-handed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's that's good. That's ah. the mull that we saw before mm -hmm. for the new hinge. This is the... Fresh. I like the way you glue that end paper out. Super. Start in the middle, work out, isn't it? Yeah, yeah? That's right. So it doesn't buckle or... Right. Buck up. Nice bit of glue. Same glue, PVA. That's right. What does that stand for, PVA? Polyvinyl acetate. Oh, that sounds tricky. Then There's I your time sheet that goes on wow. the floor. Wow. Voila. Right, and uh, it's done. Um, um, oh, setting the joint there. Yep. Setting the joint? What does yeah. that mean? Oh, I see. Sounds like a country western song. Yeah, doesn't it? Yeah. No, it's setting the joint. Yeah. 
Now I turn this over. Oh. Oh. Now this one, you're not going to do the same operation, are no, you? No, this is different. That's just the one that's a little bit loose. Marie showed us that before. Yeah. Oh, you wash that brush in water, right? Okay. That's a lovely little brush there. Fan it's brush. Like we thought we knew tail. how to fix this. So first I'm going to do this. Oh, you, oh, that makes sure that you, your glue goes in a straight line, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So you don't glue the wrong thing. You don't get glue where you don't want it to be. You That's don't get right. any on your fingers, do you? That, I, I'm very impressed by that. I, I just usually... washed my hands. So oh, did you? I usually get a lot of glue. Heather, you sound a little bit English to me. Is that right? Are you a little bit English? Um, I did live there for a while. Oh, ah, yes. Yeah, so you, you have that interesting uh, way of speaking that yeah. the English have. It's you know. certain something. Yes, you know, you've heard those English people speaking, mm -hmm. haven't you? They have that sort of very, very talking like that. Yes. Heather does that. Mm -hmm. You're going to do a little yeah. knitting while the book dries. Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Pearl one. <laughs> Drop one. Knit one, pearl knit one, gem. pearl two. <laughs> right. What is that for, Heather? What are you doing with that knitting needle? What are you doing um, with that? She's putting glue all over it. Heather? I'm going to put some glue down the joint. You're insane. Oh. I have never seen this done before in a book bindery, so this is a, this is a first. There's a method to the madness now. There is. It's like the greasy pole, isn't it? Yeah. This can get kind of messy. Oh, so you're going to insert that well, into the... Well, isn't uh, that mar marvelous? Look at that. It's coming away oh. from the book. It's like the man putting the sword through his head, isn't it? Yeah. It's like a sword swallow. Yeah, it really is. A, it's a freak show, isn't it? Yeah. Do it from both sides. Golly. Try not to pop through the end paper. Uh-huh. This is a big secret, I think. Now, now the whole world knows. Yeah. I think they'll be better off for in. it. Put some silicon release paper. Oh, oh, the Silicon Valley paper that we saw before. Mm-hmm. That goes in and then... Oh, t don't forget to set the joint. Joint. Yeah. And then I put Oh, look what's happened to this tape. Oh, yeah. We yeah. saw that. That tape's very bad, Heather, you know. Yeah. That could damage the book. Dominic, I'm going to use some of the tape on one of your books. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, and look at this beautiful. Book. Oh, it's a lovely print. Oh. What are you doing? Oh, I see. That, that, this puts the pressure on it, yeah? Mm -hmm. Now, these boards have these metal edges that bite into the joint. Uh-huh. Oh, what like, do you know? I know what my eyes see. Oh, okay. Is that it? Uh, yep. Feather. It was too bad. <laughs> Thanks very much. No problem. Yeah. I'd like to present you, uh, Heather, with this feather. Oh, thank I hope you. that together you will be happy. Thank right. you. What a beautiful feather. Yeah, it's quite all right. See you next time. What else do you have up your sleeve? Uh, well, we have mm. an another thing to look at. Okay, mm -hmm. let's move on. Great. Thanks, Heather. Oh, here we are in the encapsulating room. Yeah. Encapsulating. Encapsulating. What is that? Well, the encapsulator encapsulates or encloses mm -hmm. documents in between two pieces of plastic, ah. like this. Oh. oh, okay, right. Yeah. And what it does is, in that sense, it protects them from dirt and when items need to be handled. Oh. They have to be flat items, right? Yes. Oh, you couldn't put books in there? Mm. Okay. No. So How about like, your sandwich? Oh, yeah, you can put your sandwich in there, yeah, mm. I think so, yeah. So, but, so maps, pieces maps. of paper that are fragile, if Ephemera. they're in between pieces of plastic, they, you, can, you can handle them, You can right? handle them. Yes, Oh, correct. this is, and this is, um, like uh, the, what's that president JFK called? JFK in Berlin. Oh, yeah, JFK. Yeah. See, it's fragile. Right. Ich bin ein Berliner. Berliner. What's that? I am a pretzel. I am a donut. Oh, yeah. pretz pretzel, are you sure? It's not a pretzel. Yeah, Hot dog. Schnitzel. And, and it's a fragile, so you're going to put it yes. into, so you're going to yeah. show us how that's done, right? Right. Good. Okay, let's go over and meet uh, Claudia. Claudia. Okay, Claudia. let's go meet Claudia. And here's uh, Claudia. Hi, Claudia. Hi. Claudia. Uh, John, I'm Dominic. Uh, Hi. You're going to demonstrate uh, this contraption here, yeah, which is called a... An encapsulator. Uh -huh. And I already have the map inside the two uh -huh. um, pieces of plastic. Mm -hmm. So I just put this magnet Ooh. thing down. A magnet. It just holds it in place. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. And then this will come across and um, yeah. make a seam. How does it work? Yeah, how is that working? It's not with heat, is it? Um, Marie? It's used uh, with electricity. The yeah. el uh -huh. electricity goes into the converter. That's a converter. And yeah. it's converted to, um, to sonics, like ultra ultrasonics. Oh, so the ultrasonic, ultrasonic, the sound waves. Oh, like, uh, like Concorde? Yes. The aeroplane. Yeah, yeah. supersonic sound. So, so, so yeah. the ball underneath there 
goes up and down very, very fast, and that creates heat, which welds. Wow. It's the welding. So are we going to see it work? You just saw you it. You just saw it. That was it? Should I bring yes. it back? Can we see, uh, ah. can we see the weld there? There's oh, a weld. that's great. Hey, you know, um, can, you I know just, like, yeah. can I just interrupt you, you guys? Are, you know, <laughs> this, I'm sure we this can save you a little money. Cost a lot of money, but because, uh, if you do, if you don't have the money for this kind of contraption, one of our broken little, books we just yeah. brought in. Um, yeah, we do this all the time. You, John, um, uh, we're doing a quick little map here, 18th century thing. I'm just going to encapsulate it like that. You see, two pieces of plastic. So you need to smash all the air out of You know what I mean? And just to seal it up. John, John, John. I don't think that'll work. You don't think that's good? No, no, it's not going to. Preserve it so somebody can use it. Uh, look, it's, it's all crumpled up in oh, there. That it's paper. already you, broken. You uh, ruined it. Why did you tell me to do that? Well, I just thought we'd save money. Look, I mean, you know, and you can, it's a zip lug, you can open it and. Oh, you're right, Marie. It says on TV they work. You know, what we've learned is you should really listen to the professionals. Yeah. Okay. And don't listen to anything you hear on TV. Right. Okay. Well, can we, can we still stay around and watch some more stuff? Sure. Okay. Sure. Let's okay. move on then. Yes. Right. Thanks. Well, we're back from encapsulating, and Marie, what's next? Well, here we have Dan, and oh, okay. he's going to show friend us. It's our friend Dan again. Hi, Hi Dan. Boys. How are you doing? Hi, Pretty Dan. good. <laughs> nice to see you. Yeah. And, and he's going to show us how to reback. Do you oh. reback? Thanks, Marie. Well, I need some work on my back. Yeah, a, a reback. That's not like one of those training shoes, is mm -hmm. it? No, 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 no. I'm going to put new cloth on a deteriorated <laughs> spine yeah. of, a, of a 19th century decorated cloth case. That's what yeah. I'm going to do. Just now technical you've technical terms. You've taken the boards off this book. Yeah, this is already just for the final stages. I've yeah. I put uh, oh, new end you've sheets. Prepped the book already. Cleaned the spine. Put a new liner. We've yeah. seen a lot of this work yeah, so today. Right. Yeah, we know all about this. So what I'll do right now is I'll glue mm -hmm. up the spine, put the spine inlay on, and rebuild the case. Okay. And put it on the book. That piece of white is going to be a, a stiffener for the yes, spine. Yes. Yeah. Right. Sometimes called an inlay. Inlay. Well, that's that's a nice word. Yeah. Okay, so that paper will stop the glue from getting on the table. There you go. You've got a nice Here little, is with a little uh, brush. I think that's called PVA down there. Same that's polyvinyl stuff. acetate, yeah, that's John. Right. Yeah. Emulsion. Emulsion, yeah. yeah. You put the glue on, right? Look at the way he puts that they glue all on. They glue the same way, don't they? Yeah, they've all got this lovely technique, uh -huh. this lovely action. That's good now. What's the cloth made from? It's starch. Impregnated buckram. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that sounds uh, sounds tricky, doesn't it? Yeah, it's like a canvas. Impregnated. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't say that. No. <laughs> okay. Now you're putting the inlay. Yes, just sticking it right down. Right. Yeah. That represents the shape of the spine, right? Uh -huh. You so measured this rough. inlay uh, against the spine. Yes, I already did that to begin with. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Because all books are different, you know that, don't you, John? Uh, really? Oh, yes. No. Now, you're leaving some space between the inlays. Yeah, I'm giving myself a, a good joint, which yeah. just didn't originally have, so, yeah. and which oh. is why it that's probably broke. That's what broke the board. The joint is the distance between the, the spine and the beginning of the yeah. cover, right? That's yeah. right, this little area right in here. Right. Yeah. Make sure everything's good in here. It's and all like words from medicine, isn't it? It's the joint, the spine, the, all that yeah. stuff. Yeah. It all comes from the body, really. Well, you know, this whole return to the body thing. Oh, it's just it's right so now. nauseating. Mm. I wish people just get on and party, yeah. don't you? Yeah. And, what, and you don't use a bone tool, do you? What is oh. that? That's a, that's a piece well, of wood? This is a real special one it's a, a friend of mine folder? made. It's made of lignum vitae. Oh, that means um, uh, living wood. Living yeah, wood. It's very flexible and yeah, I can very hear tough. it scream when you use it. Mm, mm. I see. So you're folding the... Uh, Inlay over yeah, a little bit little too. Yeah, there's a little turn in there at the top. Oh, okay. Yeah, why do, why do, why do you turn a little bit of that inlay over too? Well, just to strengthen it some. Oh. You know, give it a the, little uh, extra. Head, you can also there, maybe huh? put a little piece of string, but this is a little oh, easier. Oh, for the you know, uh, that for library right style here. binding. Yeah. Okay. That's really just quite a quite yeah, a straightforward a thing, really. Uh -huh. isn't it? And you just went right over the cloth. That's it. Oh, so you choose a cloth that's compatible. Yeah, sympathetic. Close. Close. And now you put the book together. And I bet you're going to press it like Heather did. I bet he's going to press it like Heather did. In one of those uh, book presses. Dominic, yeah. I'm going to press it just like Heather did. Great. Wow. Heather got a feather for pressing her book. I wonder if Dan will get one. OK, That would be see. really nice. Well, first I'm going to have to just set the joint a little oh, bit. Oh, yeah, he's going to set the joint. set the joint, Dan. We know all about this, Dan. Yeah. Heather set her joint. She did it on both sides, though. Oh, you're going to We do can it. tell you about setting joints. Yeah. OK, over to the press. OK, let's okay. go. 
You got a press just like Heather's. I'm just gonna uh, be with you right here. I'm right yeah, next okay. to you, Dan. In case here's any delicate problems. Yeah. We're here. Yeah. We're here. We're here for you. Yeah. Hey, be careful, Dan. Yeah. yeah. Let me get that just right there. Yeah, we're all in this You're together. You're using those right? same uh, metal rimmed uh, That's right, yeah. boards. Yeah, John's obsessed with those. Mm. Nice. They're sexy. Yeah. Maybe, maybe an impregnation or something. Yeah. yeah. I'm not going to do it real hard right away. I'm going to check and make sure it's straight. Okay. Just going to mm -hmm. give it a little kiss, huh? And John, will you then. stop it? Okay, put it down, Dad. Put it down, Dad. That's it. That's it. Okay, and it dries there for a bit. We got a little drying time. time. Yeah, just, minutes. just a short, short time. Oh, five, okay. five, ten minutes. We'll come back and have a look at it. We'll touch base with you later. Okay. Thanks, Dan. Thanks, guys. Well, leaving Dan to have his well-earned break from the... He's having a cigarette. I think he must be. From the work he's doing to have. Delightful Siberian novel. We're going to move on, and John... Next station over, here we are with Joanna. Oh, hi. Hi, hi Joanna. Hi, Joanna. Nice, nice to see you. Uh, and Marie. Marie's going to tell us a bit about what Joanna's doing here. What we have here is we have pa pages that have been photocopied uh -huh. um, to be tipped into this textbook here, and uh, they were they were torn out. They were or... torn out. Mm -hmm. So you get them out. from somewhere else that has them, photocopy yeah. them. Right. Maybe another library. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Or s sometimes if we have the book in, in this library. Uh -huh. Yeah, you'll just go photocopy right. it. Right. And we photocopy it on both sides. It's, yeah. It's double sided. Mm -hmm. And then um, Joanna tips it in. Joanna, why don't you? What do you um, mean by tipping in? Tipping in. Um, well, let let's uh, Joanna. Let's why don't you take start? A look. I bet it involves glue. Yeah. Yes. Um, what? You what? See she, that old what glue she, bot. Yep. What she is doing first is she's uh -huh. going to trim the edges so she can make it more of the size yeah. of the, of the uh, text. Oh line. yes, I see. Okay. Um, be, because the pages that they copy on are eight and a half eight by half eight, eleven, eleven, and sometimes the text pages are a little bit smaller uh -huh. or larger, so she's going to trim um, around to three sides. And I that yeah. that bulldog clip keeps the pages in place. Yes. Yeah. Well, she trims. Oh, that handle that she's pushing yes. down there. Right. And now what's next? Do a well, she's uh, applying. PBA now. Yeah. Now that all the edges are cut. Oh, and she's right. fanning them out just a little right. them out. So you get glue on each edge. Right. Yeah. Because you only need a very small amount mm. of adhesive to hold the pages together. I see. And you don't want it too much adhesive because then they might not open. Right. Uh -huh. exactly. So there's about what, four or five pages there? Yes. And she's oh, going to drop them all in at once. Them in. Right. That wow. really saves time. And she, she's already, if, if there was um, pages that were torn out in yeah. the gutter, yes. um, she's already taken the, oh, the I remaining see. The pages stuff. out. cleaned the out stubs, that area. Yeah. So there's an area for them to go in. Right. right. Now, they look like they're overhanging a bit, but presumably they're going to get cut off right. yeah. afterwards. Yes. Oh, they're going to get cut off right now, it seems. Here are yes. the scissors. Oh, and she's just going to trim the edge. Right. I see. It's a pretty efficient way of, of trimming with, yeah. the, with the scissors, but it does take a lot of practice. Yes, and it, it, it saves time over using a scalpel and a straight edge because yes. you, yeah. you, you don't have to set it all up. She seems to be doing it very straight. And Good. when it's all done, you can hardly tell that yeah. pages were tipped in if yeah. you look on the side. Right, I right. see. And just a couple more to go, it seems. Yes. And the whole thing's done. It's nice to see it. Um, happened so quickly you realize that this kind of repair can be can be done implemented very easily yeah well i wouldn't say easily it <laughs> takes a little practice oh it takes a lot of tra yeah. you had to be trained to do it certainly sure. yes. but once you once you've got your skills mm -hmm. you can get through a good amount of work mm. That's right. right but you wouldn't recommend people trying to do this at home no no no, no. you need to know what's going on right? yeah yes exactly Good. Okay. okay Thanks. And we're that is uh, wonderful. Joanna, before you go, I'd like to present you with this dried <laughs> okay. artichoke uh, as a token. Thanks. Okay. Thanks, Joanna. Now, it's back to Dan. Well, we're back at uh, Dan's uh, station here. Dan's desk. Dan's desk. And here he comes. Where the magic his happens. It's been nipped and tucked in the press. Hi, yeah. Dan. Oh, it's out Hi, of guys. the press. So, what are you going to do now? I'm going to lay the end papers down. Okay. okay. And put the old spine back on the book. Okay. Right. And then put it back in the press. You've got 45 seconds. All go. Right. Go. And he's taking the paper out of the drawer. He's coming around, out of the gate. Around the All right. Okay, so we've we've seen a little bit of this before, but yeah. it's good to see. Uh -huh. Oh, oh I see. Look at that. Can you see that? Look at that. He's put that there to support the board. It's That's very supportive. Great. 
Um, it's San Francisco, after all. Yeah, I, 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 I got to take this out. This uh, is no yeah. longer necessary. Oh, uh, take that barcode off. You don't want that stick on right. Heather's right. back. Mm. It's a nice little brush mm. you got there. Mm. What's it made of? It's, it's uh, bristle. It's a kid's paintbrush. No, it looks, no looks, looks like it, it costs like $58. Yeah, more like a dollar. It's great. But I like them. They so you good. glue out the end paper, and then you have to glue out that little strip of uh, super, super, right? Super there. Okay. Just like Heather. Just like Heather did, yeah. A little sloppy. And then... The He's breaking the land speed record here, Dan. He's very fast, you see. Mm -hmm. He's, he has to get home, you see. Yeah. I'll give it a little push. Uh-huh. Do the same on the other side. Uh -huh. This is all he looking is very nice. Being supportive again. You've got... Yep. You, you're, you're running out of time, Dan. You, you only got 45 seconds left. I can't work under all this pressure, Dominic. Ugh. Oh, I hear your train coming. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, OK. Yeah. It's coming up. It's coming up. What's that little? Yeah, watch over there. Yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah uh, get that rid of that little thing there. Stop oh, no one will know. No one will It'll disappear. OK, you do what Heather did. You put a piece of paper in, uh, uh, underneath there to little, protect the rest yeah, of the Yeah, just so I can, little, don't have to think there. about that. Right, so you don't have a, to worry about it. That's a good thing to do. You should do that with your book, John. Maybe it wouldn't be so messy if you did uh, that. P close the book. I that's tell it. You about this. Oh. OK, and I'm going to put the old spine back on. Oh, the spine oh, has yeah. to go back on. We know that, that's don't gonna we? going to go in the that, press. That spine is really the best part of the book, isn't it? Yeah, it says, uh, look, it, it says, says... Tent life. It te tent life in Siberia. Tent but it actually life says, in Siberia. In Siberia, like somebody's falling down a cliff. Uh-huh. <laughs> OK, let's take these okay. fuzzies off. Yeah, take off the fuzzies. Yeah. yeah. Now, this is just an old, thin... Old, thin linen. piece of brittle book cloth. Uh-huh. I like the way you glue it in one direction, then you hold it at the top and glue it down, so you yeah. can, it, it never shifts. So the glue doesn't go anywhere you don't want it to be. That's exactly right. You guys did this before, huh? This is a master at work. And then make sure you get it the right way up, because jo John tends to put his on upside down, you know, when he does his rebacking. Don't you, John? You always forget. Yeah. Upside down and backwards. Yeah. There it is. That's really rather remarkable. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it comes out to be a very nice sympathetic repair. Sympathetic? Yeah. Yeah. Right. I right. strive for sympathetic sympathy. and supportive. Yeah. What an empathetic repair. Thanks. Yeah. Dan. It's I been feel your binding, Dan. Right. Yeah. Yeah. It's been I real. I share your binding. It's been real. And it's going back in the press. Yes. Yeah. And then it'll sit and cure for several hours. Mm-hmm. I feel like I've been here before. Yeah. I got that. Dan, we're here for you. The garbage can is really important. Oh, you, yeah, oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Putting it back on those uh, metal rimmed boards. Have you, have you ever, this is a beautiful press, by the way. Yeah. You ever trapped your fingers in there, Dan? Nope. Oh, I trapped my fingers in a guillotine once, you know, I tried to undo it with my teeth. <laughs> and then I realized that my boss is in the room, so I asked him to help me. Come around. Yeah. He laughed, he didn't. He laughed and laughed. There we go. That was long ago. Yeah, I laughed. Now you can that's it. Quite tight. Now it'll sit under, you know, medium pressure and cure Good. for a while. And Good. it's Dad, all done. I'd like you to have this feather. Thank you very much, Dominic. And uh, so we'll, we'll see you in the bar later. Thanks, right. Dan. Thanks. We'll buy you a drink. Bye. Hi. Here we are with Ruth. Oh, hi, Ruth. Hi, 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 Ruth. Hi, Ruth. Nice to meet you. Glad to meet you, too. Okay. Thank you. Right. And Thank what are you going to show us now? Well, I'm going to show you a book that's been repaired and mm -hmm. take the dust jacket off and put a new one on. Oh, oh okay. so the dust jacket has over it a yeah. piece of plastic, right? Yeah, yeah. kind of um, really bad. Getting so, beat up a little bit. Yeah, it's already. Yeah. So you're going to put a new one on? Yeah, a new one. Uh huh. Oh, so. This one. Yeah. Look how long the dust jacket is when you take it off. Yeah, and the new one is over here. Oh, okay. A yeah. much cleaner one, so. Oh. Good. Yeah, so. No, it's so you're just going to wrap this around? Yeah, well, not wrap jacket. it, but put it here and then take a bone. Oh, that's nice. It looks like it's on a tissue background to, so yeah, that you can carry it. Yeah, the tissue on the back, yeah. Thanks as a carrier. It. Yeah, get your yeah. hands off. Oh, sorry, sorry. No, that's okay. I, no, I washed them, but uh, you know, yeah. you don't know where I've been, do you? I don't know where they've been. You had to fold it up to do it. Okay. Uh -huh. 
I have to use a bone for that. Oh, here's another bone for yeah. yeah. To get Perennial favorite. The bone yeah. So this is like one of the most basic ways you can do the library. It will take care of its books. Well, need to protect the cover. Too. Just on the outside, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah, just to protect the cover. Yeah. So actually, the and book itself is fine. Put some tape on it, yeah, in the middle to right. hold it together. A bit of tape. Some tape. Mm. Yeah. Now we were using <laughs> scotch tape before. We were told yeah. off. Yeah. I guess it's okay for this kind of thing, huh? Yeah, the tape won't pull down. Okay. Uh, so it's invisible too. So it oh, wow. Uh, that makes all the difference. Yeah. Invisible yeah. tape. Invisible tape. Especially, it makes the book look much yeah. better. Make it's a note, Dominique. I know. Yeah, it makes it protects the book and it, it much looks more cleaner too. Yeah. It does. It's so, it, it's nice to see you doing it. It looks, you make it look so easy. <laughs> well, I think anybody can learn how to I wouldn't go it. near a piece of that stuff. To no. protect their um, books. Okay. So the tissues come off. Yeah, and then oh, I, the I take, yeah, and then I cut it over here. Oh, oh okay. Out of the end stuff, yeah. Now what's this contraption here? Yeah, well, I mean, just don't put your fingers in. Uh -huh. It's called a cut trimmer. Oh, yeah. a cut trimmer. Yeah, see? It's kind of redundant, isn't it? Yeah, and see, the book looks much better, the cover. Yeah, it oh, does. Look, oh, it looks better already. Cleaner, yeah. Mm. It's the creation of the American yeah. Republic. Mm -hmm. That's the name of the book, oh, by the way. It deserves it. Anybody who's interested at home. And uh, Ruth's almost finished. Yeah. <laughs> I'll have to hurry you, Ruth. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I mean, I know we've, we've, I got, we've got deadlines here. Oh, I you know. know. I'm I mean, sorry. Your, your lunch break <laughs> coming up and Do so I on. Have right. Right. Oh, you have, okay. Small lunch. Um, right. And there it then is. Then you hold, no, you have to tuck it. Oh. Uh, and then you take the tape. And then you put it here, and then you hook it onto the other side. They use more tape in libraries than I thought they did. But it's well, on the outside of the mylar. Oh, it's uh, on the outside of the mylar, so it doesn't yeah, matter. Yeah. It's yeah. not touching any paper. Yeah. Thank you, Marie, yeah. for keeping us up to date with conservation practices. Yeah. It doesn't interfere with the book. You see, John, huh. that's a mistake I think you made. Yeah. Why'd you tell me to do that? Well, because, you know... You've got a lot to learn. And we're coming around the clubhouse turn. Uh, <laughs> okay. You're almost there. It's a lovely uh, dust jacket. It would be a shame to throw it away, wouldn't it? Yeah. I always throw my dust well, jackets no, away. I, I, I get rid of them immediately. Okay, there you go. Thank yeah. you. That's great. Yeah. Thanks, Ruth. Thanks, Ruth. Thank Thank See you, you later. Okay. Well, after all that book repair, we're a bit shagged out. We thought we'd yeah. take time off and... Uh, uh, relax in the bindery prep. Spend a bit of time in, in the room. Marie. Marie. Um, would you like to introduce us to Dave and uh, tell us what we're going to look at here? Mm -hmm. Yes, this is Dave Power, and he hey Dave. Is Hi, Dave. in charge of the entire bindery preparation operation, mm -hmm. which means he takes care of preparing materials to be sent to off-site bindaries. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. So some of the work that comes into you actually gets uh, farmed out to other bindaries where it's more cost-effective? or Yes, that's right. Uh -huh. yes. So could you tell us about some of the, the prep that you do on the books that we have here? Sure. Uh, this is an example of a book that's damaged. Uh -huh. oh, yes. oh, that one's split in, in half completely. And yeah. um, so we can send that to the bindery. Uh -huh. and that's all. Now, the assessment's made in the ah, to It's in not cost effective for you to do this right, work Right, usually Marie makes uh -huh. the so decision. So this looks like something that was made next door. That the, this amount of preparation mm -hmm. was done to this book, right? Right, yeah, this was, uh, I think Dan did this. Yeah, put okay. End sheets on here, mm -hmm. and then uh, at the binder, they'll, the just, they'll just put a cover oh. on it. And it ends they'll up put a cover on it. Looking like this, right? Right. Yeah. So that's it has a cloth case. Very strong, durable cover. Yeah. And, and all the uh, information is printed on the yeah, spine. Yeah, we usually right. include a slip that yeah. tells them what information to put oh, okay. on the slip. Right. And, uh, that's all done slip. by computer, I, I assume. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Very yeah. interesting. Nice cloth. Nice strong end paper, and it has a new slip in here, yeah. and it has a new bar yeah. code. Yeah, once it comes back from the bindery, we do all the processing. Right. Oh, you do that here, right? And then you send it back out in the circulation. Right. Stamping, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, uh, now there's another kind of uh, bindery work that you may phone. send that you may send away for. This looks to me like a, just a regular inexpensive paperback. Just paperback, yeah. Um, and this is something that a library bindery might do with that. Can you I'm, right. I'm not sure quite what they've done here. Have they put a hard cover on there? Yeah, they put a hard cover on there, and then they, they remove the uh, actual ah, cover of the paperback. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And they laminate And it's got it. a... Oh, it's laminated. Laminated. Plastic. It's got this very, very durable right. uh, 
cover put so on they haven't there. changed they haven't done anything to change the way this book is is is, is yeah. uh, sewn or, or, or glued here but they've put this hard cover on yeah they put an end right. sheet on there and they just right cased it in like they did good mm -hmm. that's interesting now what's this one uh this this looks intriguing too yeah, we've these got are, two books here these are magazines that come into the the library uh -huh. mm -hmm. um you know either monthly or by bi bi-monthly yeah and once um either a year or half a year comes in yeah then we send them off as a group, you know, right? To get bound oh, into a hard. Dave, stone. do they make you take all the staples out? Um, no, we send them and they remove oh, the staples. Lucky. They have a machine that so. removes staples. We have to do yeah. them by hand when we work, and you're very lucky here. That's right. When we work at home in our yeah. small book bindries, we have to do all that by hand, hmm. and we're not insured mm -hmm. for that kind of injury. Mm -hmm. This cool. opens very nice. I trained my it? dog to do that. Oh, have you? Yeah. Um, yeah. This this is really nicely functioning. It, mm -hmm. it, it throws itself up nicely, as you can yeah. see there. Um, so it's a very tough binding, isn't yeah, it? Like six months of, of magazines. Right. right. This is um, New York. What's that? A magazine? Yes. Oh, magazine. Never heard of it. But there it is. Mm -hmm. It's great. Thanks. And we have and there's oh, another thing here. Can you explain this to us? Sure. These are um, either books or pamphlets that are. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Here's usually, a pamphlet. Usually thinner than you know. Another an average book. Uh -huh. right. So they would get what's called a pam bind, which is short for pamphlet bind. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so that gets done at the binary oh. also. And that's um, a piece of stiff yeah. board mm -hmm. here. Uh -huh. Stapled in. Stapled in. Piece mm -hmm. of plastic here. Stapled through the book, through yeah. the pamphlet. And uh, what's the purpose of it? To protect it? To give it some? Right. Check the edge? Yes. Oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. And it also has a nice clear cover, so you can yes. see the. You can the see the cover. What a curious way to read, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, you can see in there where the staples mm -hmm. go through. Yeah. Wow. So that's cheap and it's cheerful. Right, and if it becomes worn and uh, and the cover is damaged, it's then easy the cover to do can, it again. Yeah, right. Now this is again. really nice. This is the last one. Now this is a, an old book. It looks that like looks like, like from one of our other shows. Yeah. And you don't yeah. do anything to this because you don't have either the money or the time or whatever, but what right. you do is what? Uh, prepare this? Make an archival structure box, for it. Right? Yes, we um, provide the me measurements to the bindery and then they will they will make a box for it. Because mm -hmm. this is really broken, right? Right, yeah. and we, we don't, um, it's, it's, not a, it's not a priority. Yeah, you can see how big this Book is. It's like from our show, Big Book, Small yeah. Books, that we did earlier. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. yeah. It's really nice. It's yeah. a lovely leather. It's a Bible. It's a Bible. It's no oh, look, Holy Bible. Mm -hmm. And um, this th this box is made then at, at the same place, is it? Yes. At, at yeah. this bindery. Yeah. And it has oh, this sort of nice way of. Folded card. No, it's not made for that book. It's not, well, yeah, I, I'm not This stupid. book won't fit in this box? No. <laughs> what, can you, what did you learn at the library? And uh, it has these lovely flaps. And I guess this is all done in the sort of computerized way, isn't it? They feed yes. the information in, yeah. gets cut, mm -hmm. and then this string is great, just winds around there, uh -huh. and that's it. Thanks very much, Dave. And you're going to show us what happens to the books once they get back here, right? They're yeah. all behind sure. you. Let's have a look at those. So, uh, yeah. show, tell us what's going on with these. So this is some of the books that have come back from the library bindery. Yeah, we, uh, we unpack the boxes and, mm -hmm. and have the books. We do all the processing here, yeah. so we add um, you know, barcodes. Yeah. And they do slips and stamp them on the top. Yeah. Oh, you stamp them. You just them. send them back into circulation. Yeah, they actually get um, like security strips done at, yeah. at the bindery. Oh, oh, those little thin strips yeah. of metal that, yeah. that, that right. um, send off the flashing uh, bleepers when you. We go should put those right. inside our pants. Yeah, I've always wanted to do that. You know, to no, like we, just, we attach the uh, reference place to the right to the reference, reference books. They don't the Also, I noticed that reference books seem to be done in gold. Uh -huh. And periodicals and so on are done in black, black. and then th these regular library books yeah. seem all to be done in white. That's interesting too, isn't it? Yeah, these are actually, actually the, the magazines are all gold or black. So oh, okay. Yeah. See, yeah. El Decor is in gold. Oh, yeah. yeah. And this is my favorite color in the world, this orange, and I can't believe that the library's still using it. Mm -hmm. um, it's, it's a crime, really, isn't it? But, um, we use it all the time. It's wonderful. Yeah. Dave, thanks very Next much. Sure. See you. See you next time. Well, Dominic, here we are at the end of our sojourn <laughs> to the uh, <laughs> preservation department. Done. Uh, we've ironed. We've taped. We've tried to. We've. I think we've, we've learned been, a lot. We've we, been prevented from doing anything. We haven't too been as helpful as we'd like to have been, but nevertheless, nevertheless. Um, Marie, uh, it's been delightful uh, yeah. being with you and your delicious staff. You're all highly accomplished yeah. and, uh, and and well managed. Thanks to you. And yeah. um, 
I think as a token, as of, a our token of our appreciation, we'd like to present with you an apron from the Handbook Miners of California. As president of Handbook Miners, I present this to you. Thank you, Marie. Well, thank you. And may yeah. you, happy may gluing. You, may you bind for many years to come. Well, thanks for coming thank by. Thank you very much. We really enjoyed it. Thank, thank you. you. Oh, now, before uh, we go, Marie, I, a word about our book. I, we, we've learned such a lot today. I can't help feeling that this book <laughs> and that we ones. had an accident with is perhaps, uh, and, and these two perhaps yeah. maybe are unfixable and may need to be we'll replaced. We'll find you some think? replacement thank copies. You. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll find We'll take something. care of it. Okay, thank right. Thanks, okay. Marie. Chuck, chuck. I think we need to find that cabbie. Let's go find that cabbie. Okay, okay. okay. See you next time. <laughs>